here we go. Welcome back to Bath Legacy. I'm Adam Whitmore. My mom, Gladys, couldn't handle me because I'm a little rough around the edges. Put your hat on. Uh -oh. I sell papers. I live on 19 North Sycamore Street. Don't track me down. <laughs> I'm an occultist, which means I study that which I fear, and I don't fear anything, so I don't study a lot. <laughs> Consult the helm. Whoever is judged gains one tra in any trait, then draws and reads this card. All right, so now you're gonna roll this die here. That's one meaning that this family judge your brains. Gain one in any trait first. That's fine by me. Sanity. Mm. I need all the help I can get when I'm dancing for those men. Chapter 10, December 1925. Dearest brethren, the time has come. We have had many names. Coven, Dark Council, Devil's Coachman, but always have we served him. The Bound Wolf. Tonight is the night. The stars are aligned. The patients have been locked and barricaded in the basement, so their screams may fuel the ritual. How fun. We must do all we can to free him. We must find a new way. Destroy the basement landing. Shuffle the tiles from planks 17 and 18 into the stack, except for the new basement landing tile on plank 18, which you should set out as the new landing. You guys ready for this? Yeah. All right. Your rest is so crazy. <laughs> oh, I barely heard the tear. All I heard was a cough. <laughs> Give each player the photograph in the tomb with their crest on it. Sweet wow. Here's mine. All players start on the basement landing. You take the first turn. <gasps> yippity doo da scoot day Here we go. Hi, my name is Dorothy, and my mother's name was Lily, and she was a very famous actress in That Girl's Got Gout. I'm a dancer. I dance at the tea room. That's my boss over there. He's a sweet man. He's very old, and he's 30. I'm 19. And also, I'm a hunter. I like to hunt men for money. Okay, hit it before it hits me, correct? You may use speed instead of might when making my attack rolls. So, let's check this out. I got fast speed when I have to dance. Doobidoo wop bop bop. Okay, here we go, speed four. One. Can you do that for me, boss? No problem, sugar eyes. Sugar eyes? I love being called sugar eyes. That's what gets all the boys to the dance room. Secret staircase with some paws. Yikes. The hallway and this tiles are adjacent to each other. Oh, so immediately you could already get back up to the hallway and the basement isn't even a problem. So that's pretty good. Some kind of cat in here. scooby doo wop bop Let's go. One, two. Here you go, sugar eyes. Thanks, old bubby. That's what I call my dad and the owner of the tea room. It's not problematic at all. Ritual room. Ooh, I got an omen card. And there's two ghosts. Deranged portrait. Probably just your imagination that its lips occasionally seem to move. What? You may make a knowledge or sanity roll. You mind if I go? Hmm. Good? Yeah, what's your name? Adam. What's yours? I wish it was Eve. Mm. You're quick, yeah, aren't that's you? Clever. Two. Let me get you a basement tie, sir. That's my boss. Yeah. I sell papers for him. That's my boss, too. Really? Really? Huh. Huh. I'm a businessman. I can't read it. Mundane elevator? All right, so <laughs> if you. Let me tell you, son, let me t it's a time, because I know your probably never had this talk with you. It's time to tell you about elevators. You can move this tile and everything on it adjacent to an open doorway on the upper landing, basement landing, or entrance hall. Bubby. We can't understand you. Well, I'm gonna keep going. Hey, how are you? Hi. Bye, too. Okay. Well, let me get you a basement tile. Bye, bye. So we're down here in the underground cavern. Ongoing events, summoning, candles in an intricate pattern, a thousand eyes floating in the air. Something is entering our world. If the haunt has started, bury it has not. Flip the eye token and place it on this tile. Each time a player enters the tile, flip the token like a coin. Eyes closed, everyone on the tile gains one sanity. Eyes open, everyone on the tile loses one sanity. Okay, great. All right, finally some shelter. I'm coming to this house. I don't know who's in here or why. My name's Puddles Puppy. Uh. Flowers, flowers, finally a break to stop selling flowers on the street. Maybe finally I can get some rest. I'm nine years old. Here I go exploring the basement because I'm cold. One. Oh, right. oh, right. I'm in the organ room with a secret passage and an event. 
But first, I should be careful and say I'm an investigator, which means sometimes cards and rooms will have events on them and I don't need to experience them. But today, I will. Flowers? <laughs> Miss from the walls. Miss powers out the walls. Whoa! I'm cold already. Now, water. There are faces in the mist, human and inhuman. Spirits that are summoned once have not found rest. Me either, because I've been selling flowers. Each player in the basement must make a sanity roll. Each result affects one of the players making that roll. Well, I really wish you wouldn't have done that event. But let's go, all right. Me so, too. Sorry. Shooksy. Now, I'm pretty sane. I'm not going to make any claims about superlatives, but I'm going to roll five dice. All right, so I got to... Three, four, five, six, seven, seven. Plus four. The faces are tricks of light and shadow. All is well. Game one sanity. You in the basement too, sir? Yep. All right, roll. Yes, sir. Oh, oh God. All right. Uh-oh. Unsanitary. Oh. oh. All right. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Plus four. The faces are tricks of light. Game one sanity. Four. Four plus game one sanity. Yes. Four. Plus four, gain one sanity! Thank you, Flowers. That's maybe the best event that you ever had. All right, now my turn. Last but not least, paddles. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Take two mental damage and place your figure on the crypt if it is in play. All right, would you mind if I go ahead and start my turn? No, sir. It's mighty gracious to you. Thank you very much. My name is America Boodle. Uh, I am a small business owner. Uh, my employee here works at the normal tea room, and in the basement in the 1920s, all we make is tea. So if you know anyone looking for tea and normal tea, you know who to go to. <laughs> scooby doo bop bop scooby doo just like how I taught her. It's just, Water? This is normal tea. Dang. Puddles probably hasn't had water in a decade. Right. Your first woman I ever saw. Really? Yeah. What happened to your mother? Dead. I'm going to go ahead and move around in this here basement now. Sorry to bother you, miss, but I'm going to scoot on by through the organ room. Oh, we got the sister. All right, so uh, it means I get to look at a basement item. Oh, I found some cultist robes. They're sacred. If you would take physical damage, you can take general damage instead. General damage. Uh, you know what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to go ahead and make this my family's heirloom because, you know what, these robes, I, I want to pass them down to my king. Uh, so, since it's my family's heirloom, I get to gain one sanity while I'm doing this, and, uh, I don't want to make any superlatives or hyperbolic statements, but I do have six sanity, so you make your own judgments in comparison to who saves the saints here. Right here. What are you gonna name it? Uh, good old American, um, normal American cultist robes. I thought you were gonna name it Dorothy. So I've gone ahead and drawn this item and I made it normal American cultist robes and made it my heirloom. But what I'm also gonna do is embarrass it for my kin to find later. Uh, because that means I get to gain two in any uh, trait. So I wanna become even more sane now. I got some insanity. And good luck to my kin in the future finding it. Maybe I shouldn't have made it my heirloom first, but whatever, I'm a businessman. Go on with your bad self. <laughs> Holy oh. shit. <laughs> oh. Alright, let's go and get you the basement, 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 grandpa. Sanity. Everyone, everyone on the tile, including you, Ooh. loses one. Loses one sanity. Oh, you You're lose pretty one. Fun. Oh, wait, you what? lose. You lose. One. You lose one. We lose one. This is worse than when I lost my bouquet of flowers and I couldn't pay for water for months. All right, it's finally my turn. Dee 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 dee, ba da sha va da da ba da 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 do. Ooh, I'm an I'm 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 an I I'm an Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I fell down the stairs. When discovered, draw the top item card until you get a weapon. Then bury the rest of the cards and reshuffle the item deck. If there are no weapons, you get nothing. Asshole bone saw. That's, that's a weapon. That's a weapon. 
The tail's in my father! Now, can I ask you a question, Sugar? <laughs> Do you want this to be your family heirloom as well? Because there can be two family heirlooms. I here. definitely want an asshole bone saw as my family heirloom. Oh, Let's fruit. have the Poppy family finally reunite, because we've had some bad blood, so my mom Lily told me. Before my grandfather vacuum Poppy dropped me on the side of the road, he told me never to speak to anyone with the last name O'Brien. So then, I'm done, and then I just hang on to this. Here we go. What's up? Papers, get your papers. Here we go, one. Search, make a knowledge roll. I'm not gonna search. All right, it's time for Nick's basement time. Boom. Uh, hand mirror of vengeance. It shows its own image rather than reflecting. You feel like you could pass through the mirror or reach through it or see the future. All right, That's I'm gonna go, I want to go to the elevator. One, two, three. Where are you taking it, Sam? I'm gonna take it upstairs. And then four. That's it. All right. I just need some of my Jesus milk. Everybody hold on for a second. Bubby. Mm. Sorry about that. <laughs> He's off the clock. This is a one, two, three, four. That's the basement. Oh, God, I think that's time for me to get an omen there, too. Here we go. We're gonna draw an omen. I'm like a good Christian man. The brooch of rage. At the start of your turn, you can gain additional moves because the number goes on your side. I think he said the brooch of rage. I did. All right, brooch of the rage. Uh, so now that I've drawn three omens, we got three omens here. I'm gonna roll three different things for the omen tile. Here we go. One, two, we're good. No honks. Now, soon, it's your turn. Of course it is. Newspaper man, can you move me? Mm -hmm. Great. Sure can. Where do you want to go? One. Uh huh. And uh, two. Mm -hmm. And three. Four. Oh, Ritual what? room. I guess Ooh. that's really all I can do. And here I Kay. go. One. Two. Uh oh. I have to. I know. <gasps> no, no, no! All of us? No, no I'm just on this time. All right. He's up here with me. Flowers. Papers. Up here, one. Oh, so, I'm so sorry. No, it's totally so sorry, fine. Yes. The common room. There's an event, but I'm going to choose to. No, I want it. A lot. Stacked furniture. The furniture in this room is stacked in the strangest of ways. The pile hatches towards you. Make a might roll. If this box is checked, subtract two from the result. Oh, All right, my might is four, so I'll row four. Subtract two from the result, so I have this result I. Got five. Mine is two, which is three. Take one physical damage. Uh-oh. Oh, God, it's hard to be in this house. I'd rather be outside in a puddle. <laughs> go, old man, go. Now, I'll have you know, young lady, I'm only 30 years old. But you're on your last year. Well, I don't know why you keep saying that. It's true. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and scoot on one for the basement. Here we go. Oh, uh, we got the vault. Um, if there's no search token here, I can use a knowledge roll. And if I use my knowledge roll, I can see if I can get the vault open. Um, and I get two items if I do that. So I'm going to start that. I'm going to make a knowledge roll, and I hope I get six. All right, let's go. Well, in my she eyes. Too. You know what I'm going to do, everybody? I'm going to consult that. I'm going to consult that. You know, say, say it with me. Consult that. Oh, I was, I was just going to do a little <laughs> finger touch. Oh, I'm good. I'm, I'm good. good. I'm all set. Man. Yeah, that's how you show respect to Bubby. You know what? That's how you show your respect. You don't kiss you the rings. That. You got to rub your face in my tummy blood. I want you to adopt me. <laughs> my daddy won't Okay. <laughs> so I'm going to control the helm, thus completing a portion of the helm, which some of the comments were kind enough to point out we've been doing wrong. Let's go. Um, I'm going to do this on the one that looks mm. like the R Sauron. All right, so let me roll four. Ah, oh, shit in my eyes. Hold on a second. in his eyes. Uh, the sturdy it's, it's, it's a It's a turn, turn of phrase. It's a turn. So since I filled up that part of the helm, I've got to turn to entry 136 to see what the heck happens to me. We crossed the endless ocean, seeking a location where the tree of life touched our world. We searched Snayland, Grainland, 
Markland, until at last we found a place where a root of Yggdrasil touched Midgard. <laughs> if I had a nickel. Uh, from here we could get to any realms. From here we could get to hell. Gain four sanity. All right, well, look at me go. I am, uh, well, I don't want to say anything too braggadocious, but I'm pretty sane. Good job, Bubby. Doesn't, I don't get to do nothing. I'm going to keep searching though later, but what I do get to do is an event. Um, the shifting room. Read this card privately. It's private. So he's shitting oh your eyes like a tin oh of fray. Boy. All right, so I had to read that card in secret, but I'm able to summarize basically what happened. Uh, I saw some visions that were so horrible, I'm not gonna be repeating them, but I took two damage to my mind. And oh. I hope nobody else ever has to see those visions again, because it was a real bummer, especially for you. <laughs> Bubby, stop taking all that cough syrup, I, I told you. Listen, I need this morphine, it gets me normal. Buster! You wanna get adopted too soon? I'm 18. All right. Up there, yes. Buster wants to go up there. You got it. Wait, do we agree you're my daughter now? No. All right. Great. Now we do have to make a hot roll at this point, and there's four oh, dice oh, to roll, so get ready. Here we go, champion. Let's go this way towards the servant quarters. I'm gonna show you the basement, but can you sing that song you know I love? <laughs> All right. Burberry and I did to draw I can the read it, Puddles. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Barry, an item card. Draw the top item card. <laughs> you don't have to do that. <laughs> right. I'm moving on up. Scooby! Oh, here what? we go. Now, you can only whisper while you're on this tile. It's a free. I like to whisper to my clients when it's late at night. So, Jaggy, oh. The hungry porcelain doll. The eyes are oddly soft. Ooh. On your turn, the porcelain doll counts as a ghost on your tile. Ooh, yucky. So, now we gotta do some kind of omen. And I'm role. done. Well, you got a one, oh, two, three, whoa. four, five, time for the hunt. Can I get a cigarette? Can, can someone light this? Can you oh, light I got it? An idea. Can you light it? Oh, Bubby, Bubby, you can't do the cough syrup. Thank you. Wow! Finally, a little bit of warmth. <gasps> Seven. You know what that means? It's time to, to be hated. The haunt has begun. <gasps> 1925. The Chris. Turn to entry 161 in the Blink Journal. We steal ourselves to face this dark brotherhood, but we are compelled to pull the photographs from our pockets. On one more words shimmer into focus. The magic stones have powers. Depending on the tile, the haunt revealer is on. Turn to the matching entry in the Bleak Journal. The piecing together of disassociated knowledge will open up such terrifying vistas that we shall go mad from the revelation. If we can open a dimension near hell, perhaps he can escape his prison. One of us is hidden among the victims to keep the ritual from being interrupted. Let us begin. <gasps> the haunt revealer should draw the next card in the legacy deck. The Chris, give it its true name, the Chris of Summoning. They are now carrying it. Wowzy, wowzy. Consult the helm. Whoever is judged loses one sanity and one might. Each other player on the same branch loses one sanity. Oh, That's a lot, Just Bubby. I mean, I mean, Bubby. I mean, I mean, M. Okay, so it's this one. So it's M. So now we gotta roll the dice. Yes. Two. <gasps> so that would be the Bible. That's Poppy. What happened? Whoever is judged loses one sanity and one might. Each player on the same branch loses one sanity. Damn it! One sanity. That's us. One sanity, one might. We lose one sanity. sanity might. You lose a lot. One sanity and one might. One sanity, one might. Just a heads up for everyone. I'm really hanging in there. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, we know. The traitor in this haunt is hidden among you. Of course. 
the heroes and traders should turn to Haunt 49. The elder thing comes in the secrets of survival book. Right, everybody, this one is called The Elder Thing Comes. Basically, we don't know who the traitor is yet. We've all been passed out random numbers, so we're all gonna be doing the same things on our turn. We're gonna move a cultist, and we're gonna place a cultist on any landing tile. If you are the traitor, which is a secret, you're trying to get all the cultists to come to you on your tile so you can invoke an otherworldly demon from beyond. The rest of us are trying to get to this portal and close it by making a knowledge roll of over 13. Now, there are some certain things that we can do to give ourselves more knowledge, such as the person who's holding the Chris. The ritual dagger can start placing runes in the basement. More runes in the basement means more knowledge. Also, if we kill a cultist, we can lose a little sanity to gain some knowledge. So it's a bit it's a bit of a trade-off back and forth. And I just want to say I love working with all of you. Sorry to hear that one of y'all is not very nice, but as a good Christian man, I forgive you. Okay, here I go. I'm moving this occultist this way. Oh, and now I'm placing an occultist here. Oh, uh, and now I'm going upstairs and fucking up this occultist. Whoa! Woo! All right, what's your mic? Four. The cultist has a mite of three, so good Ooh. luck. <laughs> Don't like that. Well, no, you got an advantage. I'm from Brooklyn. Woo! Woo! There's a five right there. You're from Brooklyn? Yeah. Nice. Where are you from? The tea room. Your normal tea room. Born and raised. That's a three, so the cultist takes two damage. Cultist is dead. Mm. Now, do you want to interrogate that cultist? Yeah. Grab it by the chin, Paul. Adam. Yeah. Uh -huh. His name is- Hey, what do you know? Uh, uh, well, well, um, I learned that uh, 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 a strawberry actually isn't a berry. Thanks! <laughs> okay, I'm going to move this occultist. Oh, did you kill this yeah. one? Oh yeah, that one's straight dead. I'm gonna put this occultist mm. in also the basement landing, and then I'm going to move myself to go fuck it up. I lost my voice. Then I'm gonna go move myself to go it up with my friends. One, two, three. Now I want to kill it. Kiddo, roll your four might against the cultist three. So that's three. Three. The occultist three. Three. So, what a match. All right, so here's my situation. The fact that you're trying to get down there and beat it makes me think that maybe you're not the devil. So I'm gonna try to do this. I'm gonna try to move this one, two, so that you can beat the hell out of it, because I know you're strong. I'm not strong, I'm an old man of 30. I'm gonna add a second one of these here, because I know you're strong and that's okay. So I don't have quite the knowledge I'm gonna need. You know what, I'm gonna help, I'm gonna help you, kiddo. Because I don't have a whole lot of might, and if I take any damage, I'm straight fucked. But I don't do need your help, help her. Live for yourself, don't worry about me. I've been fine living on the streets <laughs> of London. <laughs> I actually am, hold on, everybody, I got this. As a strong Christian man, I'm gonna talk to this cultist and say, I invoke the power of the Lord and I hope you can see the light. Okay, so that's gonna be three. Someone else wanna roll these three die? I'll roll for the cultist. <gasps> There's a two, so I'm gonna say, listen, as a strong Christian man, I'm gonna take the route that Jesus would. So I light him on fire and send him to hell. And so I'm gonna lose one sanity and gain my knowledge. Bubby. Are you two married? No. no. It's your turn, Buster. Buster gets to place one. But move one first and place one. Sorry about that. Uh, can you move two? I'll move two. Ah, there. Boom. That's and now you place one. There you go. Beep! All right, so now what'd you like to do on your turn, Dark? Let's bloody this fucking Chris. All right, so you're going to make a sanity roll for us here. You got a four sanity. Why don't we go and make a four sanity? Correct. All right, so you get to loot. You lose one sanity in mind, but we get to place a room token on your child. But it's a really good thing that you did, because we can't without you. Dorothy, I never steered you wrong before. I'll never do it again. You're right, Bubby. One, two, but. Yeah. <sighs> can't wait to sing, right, Bubby? Yeah. You promise. I promise, when you turn 28, you got this. Wow, that's a, that's a lot of, that's a and lot of And now the occultist is gonna roll. Hope they don't get a six. 
Well, f my bones, it's a five. <gasps> five to five! A square up trial! <laughs> I'm done! Thank you. You know what? I would love some shit, actually. Uh, Blue bedroom. Mishappen figure. A mishappen. misshapen. <laughs> <laughs> misshapen Reach. figure leaps towards you, grabs at your throat, and wraps you up in its long arms. Hot. Make a might or speed roll. Whoa! Woo you struggle free. F you. Get out of my life. All right. I'm feeling really confident. Maybe I'll get them all and I'll beat them. Okay, so I'm going to move this monster one, two, and place this one here. Yeah. And why would in why would you do that? Why would I do that? Cause none of you bought my flowers. <gasps> Cause I'm the traitor. Ah! So here's you go. So you gotta invoke. You reveal your number token. Show us your number token. The receipts. I'll show you the receipts, <laughs> Daddy Warbucks. Oh. It's sideways. <laughs> so what this also means is that now that the traitor has been revealed, they take control of all the cultists. So there's your large monster. All right, now it's been revealed. None of you bought more flowers. And now we're not going to. Because they smelled like trash. They smelled really bad. Trash. Yeah, no, yeah. that's, it's because of me. It's because well, I piss in my pants. Regardless, they, wait, wait. <laughs> we know. Because yeah, I got was, no toilet. It was ragweed. I'm going to take one of my small monsters and go up to Buster. All right, my turn is still going. So I'm going to take this road here. One, two, Three, and I'm gonna hang out over there in the vault. Is this done? My turn's done. I've got an idea, all right? You guys remember this whole vault situation? Yeah. So I'm gonna walk over, I'm gonna go one, I'm gonna go two, and I'm gonna study in this vault. And so I'm gonna roll four for my knowledge dice and see if I can get a six plus and get two items. Yeah. Well, he does that, I look him in his eyes. Doesn't matter. Six items. All right, six things. I get one basement item. All right, so I got a cask, which can, uh, I can. I can, let me, shut the f up. <laughs> Give me one second. Um, all right, so I can drink from this cask, which is really nice. Um, Flask? Cask. Got it. Oh. The odds of that. Yeah, there you go. Bubby. You des he deserves it. Bubby. I, He's I've about to a kill a little day. girl. So this cask, I'm gonna use my will to do to immediately bury it and gain two in any uh, situation here. So I'm gonna get my knowledge up to five because that's using your noodle. Then I'm gonna also bury this, uh, no, I'm gonna chime these bronze bells to gain one sanity, boom, up to eight, very sane. And I get to move everyone one tile, ignoring obstacles and then bury this card. So I am going to move uh, this one over here. I'm gonna move this one over here. Oh, you're doing I'm gonna this to move save your friend. This one over here, this one over here, this one over here. I'm gonna scoot you past all these obstacles right here. And then, um, look, can I, can I move her off into hell? Uh, yeah. The little girl that called Puddles. Look at me in the I eye when you do it, Daddy. <laughs> Don't call me dead. So now I have a bunch of knowledge. That was one, two. Uh, you count as an obstacle, so I'm gonna go back down here. Let's go, Buster. <laughs> That's, that's an eight, so it doesn't close the portal, but good try. That was really close. Was first yeah. Here. That was really good of you. Good going. Sweet, Buster, my turn. I'm gonna use the Chris of Summoning to start. Get All the, right, I'm gonna make a sanity roll with the Chris of Summoning. Hey! That one doesn't count. With the Chris of Summoning. You wanna use one. the helm? I'll use the helm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, also, uh, which, which area do you wanna complete? Mountains. Turn to entry 155 in the Bleak Journal. We'll see what happens. The wolf keeps arising. The Godar cannot kill him, for he has already eluded death. Ooh, his hound keeps him alive. The normal methods to kill his kind do not work. Nothing of our world can kill him. Hell will not take him from our world, so we must find a way to take him to hell. Hmm. 
We are preparing our ships to cross the Great Sea to find a branch of Yigrasil. 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 You know, you got it. Gain for knowledge. Oh. Sh Other <laughs> players may read this entry again at any time, but do not gain the trait bonus. Yeah. So Suck my dabadoo doo doo ba da ba. <laughs> We need to get that girl upstairs. Yes. Do you want to use the Chris first? Get me upstairs, first? please. Finally. She already used the Chris. I didn't use the Chris. Oh! So we're nice. re-rolling so now. So now I get to re-roll my try, sanity. Try your three again. I'm so excited. Roll, I can't. Roll three. Oh! Baby. Ah! All right. Hey. All right, so. Whoop. Oh. Uh, place the Chris as far as you can on any tile within line of sight. Gain one sanity. So you do gain one sanity. Chris would be in any of these directions, line of sight. Let's go ahead and say it goes over here. Yeah, great, perfect. So I still get to go though. My speed is four, so here I go. Bop, 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 bop. Don't touch I'm me. I'm sorry. One, and I'm gonna take my crease with me. Chris, crease, cry. One, two, three. Okay, great. Uh, crawl space, which has an event mm. and a secret passage. <gasps> but it's foggy. Uh, minus one die when you're rolling on here. So uh, we got an event, basement event. We got Let the chasm go. here. <gasps> and you can explore the other worlds if you feel you like it. You can explore the other worlds from this tile. Uh, do you want to continue forward one more space? Of course I do. All right. I'm a progressive woman. We got the operating theater. So you can either operate uh, by making a knowledge roll, which will be very beneficial to you, and you get an item. I want to operate. Great. So then uh, go ahead and make a roll of seven. Wow, wow, we will. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Oops, whoa. Uh, one, two, one, three. two, three, four, five, seven. six, seven. So you get to heal all your traits back to normal. It's Shut plus. up! Yep, that's the operate. Us flapper dancers are very healthy. Just our feet are broken. And you get a basement item, which is this. <gasps> hey, it's the thing I married. I knew I married it. You have some rough handwriting, I'm not gonna lie, Bubby. I have no idea what this says. Normal American cultist robes. Can you read what that says? Exactly, see he doesn't know either. Normal American cultist robes, sacred. The pocket contains small bones, okay? If you would take physical damage, you may take general damage instead. Here we go. Come on, Adam. One, two, I'm gonna f that up. All right. Give me your best shot, Get up, bitch. Four. <laughs> that was Everything crazy. Take so long. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six. Nice. I'm rolling. Oh, now what? Really well three. No, you're rolling these three. Cursed. Look me on the eye when you do it, Adam! Four. Fuck it up. So we, you called us dead? Yeah. Yep. And now I you can interrogate? interrogate it, yeah. You want to? Great. Yeah. Perfect. What, what do I do? Grab him so by the lose, chin! Lose, lose one sanity, yep. gain knowledge. Do you want to want to go try to make that portal? One, two, three, four. Yeah, let's go. All right. Boom. Make that portal roll and max one, it out, baby. One, two, three, four, five. Portal roll, portal roll. There's no ghosts on that tile, is When there? I go to the bakery, nope. I order a portal roll. <laughs> okay. Do you want, do you want Consult to? the hell. Consult the hell. We like so you, church. Do you want, we, we like, like church. church. Which one? Oh. Um, let's see. Am I going with crosshatch, bird? Let's bring it back home to the D. Oh, classic. classic. All right, Whitmore so family. now we get to have you read entry 56 in the Bleak Journal, please. Gain four sanity. Shut the f up. Hell yeah. <laughs> the stones have been laid above the world tree. The Godar marked them in the runes, warning them all to leave, lest he awaken. A few of us still believe in him. Me and my wife and I bled into a chalice. She drank from it, and then we buried it. Okay. Wow. Sounds like a good time. Plus four sanity for you, and you get to reroll your knowledge for the portal. <laughs> One, right, two, three, four. But... That was huge, because now I can huge. go fuck up At least you like church. I'm gonna run! <laughs> <laughs> I have no knowledge and no sanity. I'm gonna run! Flowers, flowers, flowers. Yeah. One, two, oh. three, four. Die. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> One, One, two, yep. and then mm -hmm. I'm there. One, two, sure. and then this yep. one. Yep. One. Yep. 
Jesus Christ! Dude, Amanda got to do this for literally 20 minutes. And that pissed I me off too! Who that is. My name is Dorothy. All right, I'm done. Get ready to look out, bitch. I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, and I'm gonna stay right there, all right? Great, cool, done, easy, sick. It's pretty book. Is he gonna say something? Nine. <laughs> He's guessing. He's rolling to close the portal. Let him cook. Close it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ten, ten plus three, that's a perfect roll, meaning the glow portal's closed! Oh, no! 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 Give me that, give me, give me that. No! Use your voice. What happens if you win? Use your voice. Use your voice. Wait, you 151 in the Blake Journal. My voice, I can speak finally. Wow! Uh, green light and terrible sounds dwindle until the portal closes. This room is forever changed, and for the rest of your lives, impossible things skirt the edges of your vision. You held off his return for now. It is something, but not enough. You must do more. Without a plan, you will allow him to escape, and then he will devour the world. After the portal clo was closed, there was silence so grim and absolute that it swallowed one sanity whole. The portal was closed, but not before restless spirits seeped through. The forbidden words closed the portal, but their harsh sounds reverberated through the building, echoing, demanding attention. The asylum is in shambles. When authorities arrive, arrests are made, and patients are relocated. The building lies abandoned through a financial crash, a depression, and the Second Great War. Upon returning from the war, a couple purchases the dilapidated structure with the hopes of opening an inn. <gasps> it's no longer an asylum. It's now an inn. Do they do dancing? No. Okay. <laughs> they also once again established that we're all mental patients. But I never died! Yeah, I should have killed oh, you. you're dead. Tree. So that's it! You're dead. We, for the first time in a long time, the heroes win! But, but, but this little one is dead, right? Yeah, let's go ahead and assume that off camera I hold her head under the water till the bubbles. <laughs> All right, before these people shit. come f me up, I'm going to say goodbye. Thank you for watching. Make sure to catch more episodes and wait till the next episode when we are in 1947. I brush my teeth.